Um, I feel that it's really happening. <laughs> First of all, because uh, like everything's happening so fast, and I'm just really happy and lucky to be able to work with amazing people who can make um, such a concept happen. Because uh, I know we're like pressed on time, but everyone still is delivering a great job. Hello. Oh, hi. Come <laughs> <laughs> Oh, are you ready to fit? Ready. I think so. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm super excited. Okay. <laughs> I have really no idea what it looks like yet. So uh, hope yeah. you like it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Of course. Pro coming from math. Okay, let's go okay. to the fitting. Alright. Oh my gosh. That's insane. <laughs> uh, that's the base. Base? Recently, we have base to... Pala? Yeah, the detail pa. It's and we put the the yeah. dragon. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the elements yeah. of the dragon. Thank you. Oh my gosh. The first fitting button, dami ng details. <laughs> this is insane. And these are the ano yung maya. I'll kopya mako pa to pag nakano na. Sige. My initial concept talaga was something fantasy and. Un <laughs> even unworldly or something. Parang something that hasn't been done. I've always like that was always my mantra, even in my crafts and whatnot. Parang even if I cosplay, I want something that hasn't been done. So for my wedding at least I wanted some dragon elements because I was also born in the year of the dragon and we're huge fans of Game of Thrones, Daenerys Targaryen and yeah, um we saw Max work. The he made a Dress that look ha that has a dragon look, parang oi, makakaya. <laughs> and true enough, ito na, we're here <laughs> and maraming pasapok, so I'm super excited. In cosplay, you have to be very accurate with a character you're copying, down to the very last detail. And sometimes those concepts are not even applicable to real life. So some are floating. You have to really think about like how will we hold it up with like acrylic sheets, maganon. But for the wedding, of course, we still want to keep it a little traditional, because of course we have our family <laughs> to watch us. Still, um, it's also like a creative work for the whole team, and I'm super excited. Of course, I'm not gonna go all out cosplay for the wedding. Parang little hints of creativity, but I don't want it to be like um, everything I've done before. Of course, na excited din na, syempre gawan kasi parang she's known for parang cosplay. Na isip ko agad na yung kakaibang gown yung yung gusto niya. Parang yeah, no, nakausap ko parang gusto nga yun, yung medyo kakaiba. Then sinabi niya na she was born in the year of the dragon. She likes to incorporate yung parang dragon elements dun sa wedding gown. Kaya mas lalo ako na excited na na gawin yung gown. Actually medyo medyo ano eh, medyo tight na yung paglapit niya sa akin. Uh, usually uh, really required talaga namin parang sa clients namin iba na 6 months dapat or or more. Uh, kaya kinausap muna ako ni <laughs> ni Gideon para if Ano, uh, para gawan. <laughs> uh, the most difficult part sa part ng uh, gown ni Alodia. I think gagawin pa lang. Ito yung, yung dragon detail na ano, yun, yung mahirap niyan. <laughs> yun yung challenging. Na sana ma-achieve ko siya na uh, ano maganda. <laughs> At syempre, dapat classy pa din. Hindi siya costume -y. Yun yung challenge eh. Mag-input ka ng uh, dragon elements pero hindi magmumukhang costume. Kailangan wedding pa rin yung vibe. Siyempre, kaya sila naghahanap ng designer para uh, maano yung bagay sa kanila. Pero, I think dapat alam nila na yung gusto nilang isuot muna. Then, dun na papasok yung inputs namin sa designer. Kasi, ano, dapat ano eh, personality mo muna yun eh. Then, parang it's more on collaboration dapat talaga siya. We are here today in Chris's second fitting here at Francis Lebiron's Atelier and I'm super excited because during the first fitting it looked really good na. so we're gonna see more details today we're gonna see a lot of I, I guess 
stuff. Because parang may mga details na they change to improve the whole, the total look of the suit. So it's excited. So we opted for a white um, tuxedo. Very classic. Chris is very simple. He wants um, very simple cuts and very simple silhouettes. So we we made sure that um, nakikita siya dun sa tuxedo niya. So it's just like two button um, tuxedo uh, uh, with a black vest and black pants. The material naman is um, it's a fine Italian wool, so it's very um, smooth and it's the right thickness for our, our weather. And the color is more of like an off-white color but a brighter color, a brighter white rather than a yellowish um, off-white. Then for the lining, we had this um, silk paisley material for the inner lining in white also. And for the vest, it's the black one so that you could see the small patterns at the back and when you uh, open the, the tuxedo. It's uh, unreal. I had my second fitting today and it's looking really, really good. It's exactly what I want. Francis really nailed it. Uh, it's like a classic white tux. I saw like a picture of James Bond and it, you know, it, it was a look I was going for and I couldn't imagine we did even better than that. So I'm really, really excited. Well, I just saw a picture of Francis's dog in a tux and I need to have the same thing for my little doggy Patek because he's going to be walking in the wedding. So I'm really excited to uh, dress him up too and he's going to match me. So we are currently here at the second fitting here at Nachtimang's Atelier and oh, this is amazing! <laughs> Grab it, this is not even done yet but look at all the details. So ridiculous. It's, it's, it's again, always, every time I'm here, it's always like better than I expected. And my mga pasabog, so you, you guys will see in a bit. I think the dragon design was very smart because later we'll show you like how it's very versatile with the dress. And the design is actually reminiscent of my signature because my signature is kind of dragon inspired as well. But since I kind of stopped draw drawing the wings, I became seahorse. <laughs> so I think it's like a same shape. Siya. So super nice. It's a, good, it's a great coincidence. So far, I am very happy and it's very comfy, so I'm looking forward to the big day. <laughs> uh, compared to the first fitting, yung nagdagdag namin ay yung... We added the details here in the neck, even the shoulders and the applique on the arms. And we added the, the dragon, the body muna. Wala pa yung wings, so uh, ano pa. <laughs> so a lot of things happened since the first fitting. Parang near rush naman a lot of things, but everything's falling into place. So super conti na lang. Like I think I think things will run well. Yeah. How would Chris react? Mm, I think he will be super surprised because this dress is very different. Yun yung masasabi ko. <laughs> Alright guys, so that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to Preview's channel and I'll see you in the next one.